is a criminal case registered under your name for tax fraud and tax evasion, and there is also a warrant out for your arrest now. There's a warrant out for my arrest. This is a recordable line, sir. I have to play this recording in the courthouse, so we don't need any interruption in this call. Sorry, this is going to get played in court? Yeah, the recording is going to be played in the courthouse. We found out a miscalculation of £1,693 outstanding under your name. So at this point of time, we have only two options. Your first option is to go to court and fight the case. In case if you're found guilty, you have to pay a penalty fine of £19,000 and imprisonment of two years. And if you want to resolve the matter outside of the courthouse, then you have to pay the outstanding amount, which is £1,693 to the government. If you found it was not your intention to defraud the HMRC, then this whole money is going to be refunded back to you. What do you want to do? You want to go to court or you want to pay and resolve the matter? I have no idea, mate. Um, sorry, this has all just sort of caught me a little bit. I wasn't expecting this at all. Do I have to decide now? Sir, over the recordable line, because I have to submit this recording to the courthouse and law is not according to you. You have to go over the law. So you have to come from the department. What do you want to do? If you want to go to court, you can simply hang up the call and wait for police. They will come to you and they will take you in custody. Sorry, when sorry. Who, sorry, police who? Police will come and take you in custody. Oh, the police, the police. Sorry, I couldn't understand you. Sorry, right, okay. Oh my God, sorry. So if I go to court, I have to pay... If, 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 if you're found guilty, you have to pay the outstanding amount and the penalty fine of £19,000. And if you want to resolve the matter, yes. you just need to pay £1,693 to the government. Oh God, how do I do that? So you have to do it online by yourself. We can only give you the transaction code of the courthouse, so you can pay directly to the courthouse. Do you have these funds available to resolve the matter? Uh... Well look, I, yeah, I mean, I can't have the police come round. Which bank you're banking with, sir? HSBC. Apart from HSBC, you do have any other bank account like Revolut, Monzo, Monis or any other bank? Uh, no, I think most of my stuff is with HSBC. So please confirm your sort code, sir, so we can generate the transaction code from our side and we will give it to you. Right, okay. And sorry, who are you calling from? Are you calling from HMRC or the police, sorry? I, I am calling from HMRC, right. in code London. In, in, sorry, where? Oh, in London. Yeah. Right, where, whereabouts in London? HMRC Inner Court, London. Inner Court? Yeah. Right, right, okay. Um, and is, I mean, have you, sorry mate, because obviously I, I, I see that you've just called me. Is, is there any way, like, have you got any ID or anything that you could show me, or is there a website I can check out or something? Sir, I can verify this call, so you don't Great. need to be worried about that. If you want to check that, is that real or not? So please check the phone. Is there any call coming to you? Uh, there is actually, yeah, someone's trying to get through now. Yeah, please pick up the line, please, please pick up the line, sir, that's my official number. Okay, hold on. Hello, this is Daniel. Yeah, this side, same officer, sir. Please open google.com and I will show you whom you're talking to. So hang on, so you've just called me on a different number. The, hang on, this is... Uh... Oh, yeah, okay. That's me, that's my official number. Please open google.com, sir. Just click on that, sir. Yeah. Now you are on the official website of government, so please scroll down the page below. Is there any phone number of inquiries? That's exactly the same number that you're calling me on. So that's my official number, so now you can tell me whatever you want to do. Oh, I will definitely pay that £1,600, please, mate, because you're calling from HMRC in a Crown Court, in a London Crown Court. Yeah, okay, I see now. So you have to confirm your sort code first, so we can generate your transition code and give it to you. Yeah, yeah, mate, there's absolutely no way I'm going to give you my sort code, because you're a criminal, you're a crook, and you prey on victims, and it's outrageous what you do. You prey on vulnerable people, you steal their money, and you use it probably for organised crime. You're not calling from HMRC, you're not calling from London. This isn't the number, you've spoofed it. I know how you criminals work. You're the person who should be arrested. Goodbye.